It's difficult to even imagine the treasure trove of history that lies behind the humble doors of the Red Barn at Heritage Park in McDonough. But it is here you will find the stories of thousands of men and women who gave service to their country, told through the displays, memorabilia, and uniforms that are carefully curated throughout the Henry County Veterans Museum. If you've never been here and you walk through here, you'll see things that, that seasoned soldiers, sailors, airmen, Marines, Coast Guardsmen never see and we'll never see again. Former Facilities Coordinator and Vietnam Veteran Jim Joyce, U.S. Command Sergeant Major Retired, was tapped to be the curator of the museum in 2010. The museum was established through the Henry County Parks and Recreation Department after late director Tim Coley wanted to repurpose the Red Barn to honor veterans. Tim Coley, late, the late Tim Coley, um, I had been working there for a few months. He asked me, he says, what do you know about museums? I said, man, I have been in a couple. He says, well, you'll learn where you go. And that, that I was in the museum business. I had no clue. None. And, and so we learned what, as we went. And I started bringing people in, and they had no clue either. What started as a small room within the barn has grown into a time capsule of sorts, living history of America's military past and present. Among the historical military memorabilia, visitors will uncover a timeline of America's past through displays, uniforms, medals, vehicles, books, photos, official documents, personal letters, and other artifacts dating back from World War I up through present times. Marine Corps, 12 years. From 99 to 2011, a couple combat deployments, a uh, couple communications, wouldn't trade it for the world. But perhaps the greatest strength of the Veterans Museum are the men and women who volunteer their time. Even more importantly, these volunteers are all veterans of various branches and are always willing to give tours, talk about the experiences, and keep history alive for those who visit. A full-size version travels all around the U.S. They're going to get an education about a lot of stuff from our from Civil War time frame to World War I, World War II. Uh, like Jim was saying, you know, you forget your history, you're bound to repeat your history. The museum is a hidden jewel, and for the volunteers, a labor of love. The volunteers also share a unique camaraderie. They have experiences that only someone who served can fully understand. And sometimes just having that brother or sister to lean on or to listen can make all of the difference for those who have served and carry back the scars from that service. Because we're all veterans. Um, we're a special breed. Being around the other vets. You know, I come up here just, you know, even if it's just for an hour or two, just to hang out, talk to, you know, my brothers and sisters that volunteer here. And it's just overall a good time. The museum also houses a library with more than 200 books and periodicals where anyone can sit and relax and read. The museum also features dozens of handmade dioramas depicting various scenes of World War II. Joy said that nearly all of the items displayed in the library, as well as the museum, have been generously donated and they tell the tale of our military's history, many with personal stories of individual soldiers, some who paid the ultimate price for freedom. This is our country, this is his country, this is my country, this is your country. So you need to learn as much about your country as, as you can. And a lot of that knowledge is things that happened in the past, because you can't forget it. The Veterans Museum at Heritage Park is located at 101 Lake Dow Road in McDonough. And although donations are welcome, the museum is free and open to the public Monday through Saturday from 10 a.m. until 4 p.m. It is also located just a short distance from the Veterans Wall of Honor. For more information, please visit heritageparkveteransmuseum.org or call 404-831-9740.